Hello guys, this is Reese from Bomberito St. Peter's Volkswagen in St. Louis. Today I'm bringing you a 2019 Volkswagen Atlas SEL R-Line in tourmaline blue with Shetland beige interior and captain's chairs. This one features adaptive cruise control, lane assist, blind spot monitoring, autonomous emergency braking, LED headlights, LED running lights, halogen fog lights, R-Line chrome accents and piano black accents around the fog light shroud, body colored paint up below the chrome line, chrome window sills, piano black treatment around the ex exterior tailpipes, tow hitch, LED tail lights, panoramic sunroof, keyless entry on four doors. Let's take a look inside. So inside the car there, sorry about that guys. Volkswagen's digital cockpit with three customizable screens there. You've got the wide screen, crop screen, and dial screen right there. I personally like the dial, the uh, wide screen on mine. Automatic headlights along with fog lights. So you can pull out on that and that turns on your fog lights. Also, you've got a coin box for storage here. You've got power windows, heated, uh, sorry, heated mirrors, uh, power windows, one touch up, one touch down, window locks as well. Remote trunk release down here. It's kind of hard to see right there, uh, but you do have that. And then you do have a adjustable steering wheel. So that little lever right there, you can pull out, push in, raise it, lower it, lock it in wherever you need it. And then again, you have this digital cockpit here. So with this digital cockpit, these buttons right here work out to be like your mouse. The, the silver tabs are left and right, and then the two arrows are up and down. Uh, that allows you to shuttle between different screens here. So you can customize what's displayed here. Uh, there's your radio, you can also change radio stations. You can zoom in and zoom out on your navigation map. And if you decide you don't want that map here at all, on the MIB2 radio, just wave your hand, touch the little map button there, and now it brought the map over here, and there's a compass over here. So there's an infrared sensor there that brings up those hot keys, and then I can swap the map back over here. That's pretty cool. Also, the backup camera is an HD camera. This is a pretty solid camera. It's the best video quality that I've seen on a car. You turn, it has trajectory steering, so you turn the wheel to the left or the right, the little yellow lines move. The green line signifies where the bumper, or where the straight back line is, and the red line signifies where your bumper is. So you don't want anything to cross that. Uh, the car does have a heated steering wheel right there, and then um, you'd have dual climate zone up front, this menu button here will allow you to push that button there and bring up the touch screen here. I can adjust temperature in the vehicle by touching the blue or the red side. I can also adjust it in the back. I can also turn up a fan for the rear or turn it off in the rear. And then still have the front running. So if you don't have rear passengers, I guess you can adjust it that way too. All right, so you do also have something called air care. What AirCare does is a filtration system. There's a little blue line that starts right here and it starts to expand and it covers the entire cabin. What it's doing is it's scrubbing the cabin or scrubbing the air that's coming, being circulated in the cabin. So basically like an air filtration system. That's pretty cool to have as well. Now the car does have uh, App Connect, which allows you to do Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, or MirrorLink using one of those two, or I'm sorry, that USB port down there. And it's hard to see it because uh, I'm in the shop open up the sunroof here so we can get a little more light but there's a USB down there and there's also an auxiliary port down there a little storage spot for a phone tray right there uh, this does have the automatic start stop feature so that button for the shut off is right there so you can prevent that from shutting off when you get to red lights or stop signs um, it's a fuel saving measure but if you don't like it that's how you disable it push button starts right there electronic parking brakes right here and then this guy here that's your park pilot sensor. And that allows you to bring up the rear camera at any point, uh, as long as you're stationary, not moving. Um, and that's your, also your park sensors at the front and the rear of the car. Uh, tells you when you're getting close to an object. So if you look in this seat here, this is a look at the leatherette seats. And I'm sorry, that's a reflection there off of the window. Uh, it's a piece of a stick window sticker still reflecting there, so there's not a mark on the seat. But that's a look at your leatherette seat see if we put some light on that there we go nice 
Shetland interior, wood grain interior on the door, and across the dash. In the glove box, that is where your CD player is and your SD card reader. There's two SD card readers there. One's for your data CD for navigation and the other's for music or videos. There's also four extra holders right here so you can actually uh, store extra SD cards. This particular car just came in off the truck. I'm going to show you the window sticker here because it's not affixed to the window yet. The extras on this one are going to be uh, the captain's chair package for $6.95. Uh, also, auto dimming mirror for 325, and the monster mats for 260. I'm sorry, 285. So this car comes in at 47, 445. Now the story about this car, I actually uh, had to order a car like this. Um, this is the car we wanted to buy before we bought our our Atlas. That's called Jack Sparrow. Here's a look at the uh, edgeless auto dimming mirror with mirror link, um, three door garage door memory there, and a compass up there. And there's a look up at the dome lights. I'm using those for light right now. Vanity mirror right here with a light and one on this side as well. So anyway, we tried to order this car. We ordered it, uh, got it here. My wife drove it, loved it, parked it so we could uh, buy it at the end of the day. And it was sold by a salesman before we could get back to buy it. So uh, that was pretty, pretty hard to deal with, but we got a good car anyway. Three seat memory right there. And then forward and back right here and here. So you've got all your seat your seat set up here, uh, forward and back, up and down, seat back, and then your lumbar support as well. Let's take a look at the second row. In your second row, it's a captain's chair seat. There's a latch set up right there, and right here, locking armrest right here. So this little dial here is how you adjust where that armrest locks in and locks out at. There's a look at your climate control for the rear. Two USB ports down there and then also there is a three-prong plug-in right there pretty nice that it does that so what's nice about these seats if you have a front-facing booster you can put it in this seat and you don't have to remove it for passengers to get into the third row and they don't have to go around the seats this little lever right here allows you to lift up push forward the bottom drops out of the seat your child seat still strapped in third row passengers climb in adjust their headrest and they're seated and you're on your way to move this seat back you just lift up on the opposite edge of the handle push and it locks and there's also a lever underneath you push up and the seat glides back there is a vent in between the two seats there and there is also a seat pillar uh, vent set up for the rear passengers in the doors there's a sunshade to keep the sunlight off of your babies in the back seat with this cup holder and uh, bottle holder option, that's a 15 cup holders, 15 cup holders in the car. Here's a look at the LED tail lights. They're one of my favorite features of the Atlas. It's a power lift gate. Here's a look through from the back. True six seater with the captain's chair set up. Here's a look up at your panoramic sunroof. That is a giant sunroof with a pop-up sunshade and a panoramic uh, sunshade as well, power sunshade. Here's a look at that vent set up on the floor in between the captain's chairs. You also have those vents at the center console. And then you have vents in the, the C pillars on each side. These seats will fold flat just by lifting up on this little lever here and pushing the seat forward. So those are those fold completely flat as do the captain's chairs. Notice the black carpet on the back of the seats. So those will fold flat so you don't get them scuffed or damaged as well when you're carrying cargo. While you're carrying cargo too, you also have seat belt clips right here to keep the seat belts out of the way. Cargo blocks right here along with cloth mats and then the monster mats as well. Spare tire is going to be below the floor here. You just lift up this floor here and it's under a carpeted dome underneath. There's a trunk light on each side and the kick out there that gives you room for maybe golf clubs or something larger there. Hidden bag hook right there. 12 volt charger port right there. And then you do have uh, again, that giant panoramic sunroof there. There's a look at that push button close right there. And you the LED tail lights. So this car does come with a six year, 72,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty from Volkswagen. A six year, 72,000 miles bumper to bumper. And if you buy from me at Bomberito St. Peter's here in St. Louis, please remember to ask for me when you come in. Ask for Reese.
you'll get a 10 year, 200,000 mile nationwide engine and powertrain warranty free of charge from the dealership. Also, we'll give you three years of free maintenance. Your 10, 20, and 30,000 mile oil changes are covered by the dealership free of charge. That's a local deal. So if you fly in from out of town, you can buy from me and still get that spectacular 10 year, 200,000 mile nationwide engine uh, and powertrain warranty. So if you're interested in this car, please give me a call, 636-290-4257. 636-290-4257 on Instagram, YouTube, or Facebook at Reese Sells Cars. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a good evening.